EFNN, The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here, Tiger Financial News Network, 10 o'clock. Tiger Financial News Network update. And what are we looking at on this Thursday, the 16th of May? We're looking at the Dow actually up two points at 39,908. Um, it has continued that leg C, even though it's by a fraction, all time high. That's, that's really fantastic action. We should still get a leg D. That'll take us into next week. Look at this V-shaped pattern that we're looking at in the uh, weekly chart that actually is either an E. Yep, I'm calling that an E right now. Mm -mm. This is going to be fascinating because got some divergence between the diamonds and the Dow, etc. But in the meantime, cash is, cash is king because cash is trading very nicely. Let's look at the S&P. S&P is trading off an all-time high yesterday, up uh, about five points at 5313 this is now, I'm calling this a leg E, so we're getting close to some kind of a pullback, but nothing yet. I haven't got any technical signs just yet. Stochastic's fabulous at 96. Let's go to the QQQ, and that is uh, up 51 cents, also a new uh, all-time high at 453.40. Uh, we've got the IWM, which is lagging a little bit. It was leading, now it's lagging, down 1 at 208.39. Uh, it has got to, to a peak. It's got a, a little way to go to the 211.68. I don't know if it's going to do it in this particular move. We'll see. Hey, let's go to gold. Gold was uh, up earlier than it was down, and now it's down 13. Did it make a new recovery high? Is this going to possibly be a peak C? No, it did. So this is the leg C, um, acting quite well. Silver was acting a little bit better, and now it is up two cents. It's actually... <laughs> It's really doing quite quite a bit better than golds of these last few days. Uh, let's go to the uh, U.S. dollar. So let's go to the. We'll go to the dollar for a moment. The dollar trading right now up 23 cents on the 200 period exponential moving average, by having made lower lows and lower highs. U.S. bonds um, down a 30 second at 118 and uh, 130 second. So it's gone to this leg D. It's gone a little bit above what we were looking at as resistance, and now it's back at the resistance. Uh, at least it's going high so that the yields are coming down. And what we want, we want to do, we want to go to crude oil. Crude oil is up at 98 cents to 79.59. Basil Chapman, Tiger Conditions Hour coming up in a few minutes' time. Hope to see you. It's going to be an exciting session. Be back in a few minutes.